Morning everyone, it's George from Oiwa and today we're just going to do a walk around video of a 1992 Honda Acti Street recently imported from Japan. It's a five speed, has four wheel drive, real time so it's always on and AC and we're just going to do a walk around just to show you kind of all the imperfections on it so you're very well aware of what you're considering purchasing so i mean this this vehicle has all of the uh options highest trim package that it can have you've got the metal bull bar up front fog lights as we kind of walk around everything looks good four-wheel drive street uh, I do have decals that will be sold with the vehicle to kind of spruce it up a, a bit. Then you have the California style mirrors, also by Honda. And as we walk around, we have some curb rash on the wheels. Treads good. Uh, there's no, no cracking in the tires. Everything looks clean underneath. Again, these decals could be sprucing up. And the other thing that we have is we also have uh, rain guards on all sides. There are some small cracks in them. Looks like these ones have been repaired. And there is a little tint um, on the interior windows to help kind of keep the cab down. What's also cool is you've got this little Honda step which is pretty comical on these um, and as we continue to go around a little bit of uh, uh, scuff there again the real-time four-wheel drive decal is here um, and I can include a brand new brand new one in there for you as well looks like a little dent here on the side that can easily be pulled out and then let's look at the tire as well. Pretty good. Again, good tread. Uh, no sun, no sun cracking or anything like that. Everything looks good. Let's go around to the side. Again, you've got the four wheel drive real time. The Street EX trim package. You've got the rear bar with the mud flap which is actually quite rare um, and then you also have the other dual wheel mud flaps this is actually a backup camera that I swear is from the late 90s early 2000s um, it turns on uh, it tur when it turns on it displays on this screen it only comes on while it's in reverse. So let's go around the side. A little scuff here. Again, real time four wheel drive decals. Wheels and tires look good here. Got the Honda step. And let's go around the side. Some scuffs here on the side. Again, accompanied by the California mirrors. Uh, this rain guard, this one is cracked. It has not been repaired. And this one is in good shape as well. Now what's cool about these is that the windows actually roll down from the inside. And I'll show that in a bit. And then on the top, we have dual moon roofs, which are great. Which you can see right here. This one actually opens up. And then this is a security camera that turns on while it's driving. And then this mounted here is actually a, a GPS, but it's only specific for Japan. I didn't want to take it out. I thought it, you know, gave it a little bit of, of character. Um, now what's cool about this in the back here, as you could probably see from the pictures, is that the rear seats fold down and forward 
Oh, one sec. See, giving you kind of optimal space. And then for the windows, you pull this, hit this button, or pull, sorry, left hand, pull this lever out, and then you can lower the windows. Interior cabs in great shape. You've got rear Honda speakers in the back. And again, plenty of room back here too. If you wanted to go camping, you could just put like a small twin bed in here if you wanted to. Um, yeah, everything is in, uh, everything's in great shape. You've got speakers in the front. And then what's also great is that there's a rear fan, comes with AC, and it's a five speed. And then the last owner in Japan actually customized this little box for some storage, which is pretty cool. Um, and it has about 110,000 kilometers on it. So like 70,000 miles or so. And it's, uh, it's really sweet. You can see like this tweed kind of felt carpeting that goes nice with the two door. There's a little bit, you know, of sun fading on the on the front door panels and on the rears. But if you're looking for a cool van, get on that van life hype. I wouldn't look any further than this. I mean, this vehicle is really, really nice.